Now, in Nova Scotia, we have, uh, with our symphony, we have a, a very special gentleman that comes down at least once a year, and sometimes twice, whose name is Howard Cable. Uh, Howard will be 91 on the 15th of December, just in a couple of weeks' time. And a few years ago, he started writing music for Western Canada. He was, uh, he was out west, he was in Lethbridge for some sort of a some sort of an event, and uh, a gentleman who owned a, a very large ranch called the McIntyre Ranch approached him and said, oh, why have you never written any music for Western Canada? You've written all sorts of things from Newfoundland, Ontario, Quebec, and even the Maritimes. He said, but you've never written anything for Western Canada. And Howard said, well, I'll do that. So I wrote a piece called the McIntyre Ranch. A few years later, uh, the same gentleman who had asked him to do that called him back out to Lethbridge, brought him back out and took him to a place to show him a bunch of paintings by a Western painter by the name of Charlie Russell. And Charlie Russell, in those days, this was before the border between the United States, I suppose, and Alberta, and he just used to go back and forth, and he had all sorts of paintings of Montana that stretched into southern Alberta. Beautiful, beautiful paintings, and uh, Mr. Thrall took Howard around and showed him all these paintings and said, I want a piece of music for every one of those. So, one of the pieces was called The Tie Rope. And somebody asked me in the band what the tie rope was. I said the tie rope was the bit that you, the rope that you tied the horse to the, uh, whatchamacallit, you know, so. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> 